All right, so this one kind of confused me and I had some real trouble figuring out how to even approach this review. I'm not exactly sure what to say about it or where to even begin. Because all the pieces are there to make a good movie and the people behind it know how to make quality content. Like Julia Louis-Dreyfus is a phenomenal actor, just watch the show Veep if you don't believe me. And while Will Ferrell has made his fair share of subpar movies, he's also made some great ones. Which brings me to the director pair of Nat Faxon and Jim Rash, who made the movie The Way Way Back. And I liked that one a lot, I thought it was very well handled and had a lot of heart. And then we have the Oscar nominated writer and the creator of the HBO show Succession, Jesse Armstrong. Someone who's shown time and time again that he knows what he's doing. So this movie should have been in capable hands, there is no reason why it shouldn't at the very least be decent. But for some reason it just fell short and managed to somehow do virtually nothing for me. I mean the humor just falls flat most of the time and I don't think I got a good gut laugh even once. A couple of smirks but that's pretty much it and this appears to present itself as a comedy. But even there it seems uncertain, like it doesn't really know what it wants to be. Because large chunks of this are basically devoid of humor and mostly focuses on the drama. And the drama does work to a certain extent, but then the attempts at humor sort of undermine it. It doesn't seem committed to either thing and doesn't really manage to find a nice balance between the two. Which just makes for a rather shaky foundation and that's part of the issue with this. But another thing is that there doesn't seem to be much of an actual plot going on. You know, something to drive the story forward and something that would make it fun to watch. Because most movies have a plot and a story, where the plot is on the surface and drives the action. Keeps the movie entertaining and fun to watch. And then the story is sort of on its own layer beneath that and that's uh, usually where the emotional core lies. That's what keeps the movie actually compelling and keeps you engaged. What makes you care. And I feel like the layer that would make this entertaining and fun to watch is missing. The emotional core is there, things are happening in that regard. Because the story here follows a family. A family that's on a ski trip to Austria and the parents begin to feel like perhaps they might have some issues they have to deal with. Maybe they're growing apart, maybe there's some resentment between the two. And yeah, they'll have to find a way to figure out uh, their issues for the sake of the kids. Which isn't a terrible premise and I think that for the most part it works. It starts rather subtle too and slowly builds and uh, the conflict escalates. But that's not the problem, the problem is that that's all there is to the movie. Since the humor doesn't work and there's nothing else driving the plot forward, keeping it interesting to watch. And that makes the whole experience feel empty and very underwhelming. Now if this wanted to be a straight up drama then that could have worked. But then it would have needed to flesh that whole conflict out a bit more because right now it's a bit thin, a bit shallow. It's just not enough to carry the entire movie and that's a shame because well I didn't hate the overall execution here because it's well directed and edited. It keeps everything clean and cohesive which also goes for the script. It's not a mess, it's easy to follow and I don't think anyone's gonna be confused by what's going on. So in that sense it's a competent movie but unfortunately that doesn't really save it. Because as a whole this just feels empty and did more or less nothing for me. And I don't even want to bring up the very end because I thought that was completely tone deaf. Like what was that even? The movie had basically just tried to resolve the conflict and then they did something that I guess was going for humor, it was supposed to be funny, but what it did was just leave us all hanging there without providing any sort of resolution at all. So yeah, I don't know, would I recommend this? Uh, nope, I don't think it's worth your time, it's probably pretty safe to skip. Or, you know, you could not do that, after all, I'm not your dad. But hey, what are your thoughts on this? Have you seen it? Did you like it? Let me know. And if you enjoyed the video, maybe give it a thumbs up or sub to the channel because that would be fantastic. And if you like, you can also support me on Patreon or PayPal through the links in the description. And as always, I appreciate you and thanks for watching.